front mount of which by Bellevue it actually is controlled inside the cabin has its own battery and everything really nice uh, option come around the car actually has an upgrade to front disc brakes huge difference when driving it really nice feature great upgrade let's come around the side here we'll show you some other things these uh, these little dimples you see here which may look like dance those are actually the factory spot welds that's a really really neat feature when you're looking at your classic car especially the like this. These are really, these cars have really started to just gain in value exponentially over the past couple of years. There's a good reason. Most of these are rotted out and destroyed. This one is like the world's Jeep. I mean, everyone just beat him to death all across the world. So to find one that's really solid like this in, in almost completely original sheet metal is an ultra rare find. This is one of the things, the telltales that you're finding in original sheet metal. Okay? Again, you can feel as you look around the body here. Nice, straight, tight gaps. If we come in the interior here, we lift up these little floor mats that we have in here to protect the paint. Again, you can see down here, and uh, we're getting a little close here. You can see this real nice, tight spot welds. Those are the factory spot welds. Those are not easily cre recreated. And again, you can see them here in the floors. Those are the areas that typically rot out. Again, just a really well kept, probably garage kept most of its life, I have to guess. Like I said, nut and bolt, so all your wheels, tires are all new, they've been refinished. Great accessory gas can here that's been, that was painted with the body to match. If we come to the back here, first thing we're going to see is jump seats. These are, uh, these are great. For the, you know, uh, the idea was you fold those up to load everything up if you had extra passengers to pop them down. Kids love to ride in them. They're actually safe. They have uh, seat belts and everything. And if you look right down there, that's a rear seat heater. 
Uh, it's a great accessory from Toyota. Not all these got that. That is a good one. Again, we'll lift up this original mat here, and we can see real nice, good, solid floors. We'll come around the side here again and point out same spot welds on both sides. Nice new weather seals, all that. 68s are a little bit different than the rest of the years in their window configurations and stuff, so it is, it is nice to see one of these. We're gonna see, again, beautiful interior, the roll bars, all that stuff's pretty factory stuff, but just reconditioned and restored. All the placards are in beautiful shape. As you can point out here, we'll see. This car is fitted with a three-speed manual, high-low range transfer case, and obviously it's four-wheel drive. We'll, uh, we'll take you for a quick ride now. We'll jump in. We'll keep it on the streets, even though off-roads were fun in them. Really, simplicity was key when Toyota built this. Uh, the idea was for it to, to go out and just go out on, on not just farms, uh, safaris, jungles, but in, anywhere it needed to go. So the key is the twist of the key. We started right up. Again, three speed on the tree. Uh, you know, obviously lights, amp gauge, fuel gauge, oil temperature hasn't uh, come to temperature yet. We have our electric wipers. A great feature. Go ahead and take it down the street here. And obviously, more in there. Blinkers, those are all working. visit us at our website, stlouiscardesian.com, or give us a call. Thanks a lot.